What up, everybody? How you doing? 
let's see. Rocker, Peanut, MC, Victorian, Cory Scats, Red Stick. Okay. What up, friends? I'm drinking. It's all good, Victoriana. Victoriana. So, um, we're back with uh, Sir Brock Von Snot the 15th. It's so glorious. Do a smoke cleanse cleansing. I couldn't sleep at all last night. He really tried, so I stayed up and lit some incense to do a smoke cleansing to protect the house from negative vibes. Cool. And I kept seeing letters in the smoke, so my friends offered to do a tarot reading. And now I think Hades and Hermes are reaching out to me. That's fascinating. What up, Boke? Hey, Loki. Hey, Ebony. How you doing, my friend? See, I know the time difference between me and the UK, but uh, Australia. Okay, so you're a day ahead, and it's five p.m. Can't be right. Oh, you're in the UK. Weren't you? Am I mistaken, Ebony? I thought you were. Yeah, it's six p.m. It's six twelve. Oh, you're on holiday. Okay. Oh, that's p.m. Oh, it would be 5 a.m. Okay. Yeah, 5, 5 a.m. Got it. That's what it is. Rain is nice when it's not constant, like what we've been having here in California. What up, Ranlia? Okay, means I can't stay though, as it's dinner time. Yeah, well, it's uh, 6 p.m., so. Yeah, rain's great unless it's flooding, which is a lot of what we have. Sounds good, Ebony. You take care. You enjoy your food. This is going to be some chaos. Because uh, Sir Brock Von Snot does what he wants. And we've got Joe? Al? I don't know. We've got somebody. Jim? We've got somebody following us around, not really doing a lot. Burn your finger making mom's dinner. Maybe you should not do that. How do you, what is, how does that work, Rocker? Hey there, duty head. 
Lou? Oh yeah, I think it was Lou. I think you're right. Oh, you just gotta feel it. Well, do you eat the crunchy bar? What? Right, right. Same for crit. Yeah. I, I mean that makes sense. But I. Or. Oh, gotcha. Okay. Nice. That's cool. It's fascinating. I love learning about people. Even though I hate people, like I don't like people, I like learning about them. I find that fascinating. Yeah, humans are weird. One of my favorite moments of people watching is at a bar. Year, years and years ago, before I met my wife, I would go to the bars with a buddy of mine and he he was a social butterfly and he just knew a lot of people and we, we knew the bartender and it was a, a swanky place, all right? Quite swanky. And, uh, we would, um, but I, I wouldn't, I, I didn't like talking to people at a bar. You know? Just not all the way. Just... Yeah, I'm watching the wrong thing. Yeah, yeah, it'll be okay. I don't want it closed, closed. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Thanks, babe. Um, but yeah, we were at a, uh, we were at this bar and, and I'm just people watching and it, it was fascinating to me to watch. I, I heard, oh, what's his name? I love him. Um, British, uh, documentary, animal documentarist, documentarist, is that a thing? Um, doc documentaryist, documentary -er? You know the voice? That old British voice? Ugh, guy's a... He's a sir. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, the old British dude. He's amazing. David Attenborough. Ugh, oh, man, I wish I could do his voice. Because he's so great. Bruh. Um, yeah, and, and I, I hear his voice while I'm sitting at the bar. While I'm watching the, these two women, they're talking, they're having a drink, and I watch this guy come up. And I, I, at first I see him and his buddy, but I see the one guy come up. And he, and I'm, I'm sitting on the other side, it's a, it's a horseshoe bar. So I'm sitting on one side and he, they're sitting on the other. And I'm just sitting there fascinated by this. And I hear his, I hear David Attenborough's voice do something like, let's see if I can do it. And, and I apologize to all my um, friends with accents, but here's here's my best version of it. <clears throat> um, let's see. Uh, I think of how to start. And here we have the the human male in his local watering hole. In his local watering hole. Uh, with his plumage in high and his heat high. Uh, but just like uh, my brain is not working. He comes in and he just he says something. They both laugh. He says another thing. They kind of nod. And then as he's talking, he kind of slowly directs to one on his left while his buddy comes up and starts talking to the one on the right. And it was, it was so good. No, I wasn't. I wasn't prepared. Rustic, I wasn't. Not at all. That was horrible. <clears throat> I don't know what my brain was doing. If I really wanted to, I could, I could probably do a, a decent accent. Not quite sure where exactly I'm from 
but it's not bad. But I do notice when I'm doing an accent, it's a little higher than where normally it would, my voice would register. My register is a little higher, but I think it's not bad. You know, it's funny, I, growing up, and it annoyed my dad to no end, I watched a ton, like I, I know I was like 15, I watched so much Monty Python that I was able to do the accent pretty perfect. Like it sounded very, very similar to the point that I was able to convince people when I was working at Disneyland, like, five years later, because I was still doing it. Five years later, I would do the accent while, because I worked in the parking lot at Disneyland. So I would be the guy on the back of the tram with the mic and I would do the accent. And I got away with a lot of stuff with an accent. You'd be amazed how much you can get away with when you have an accent in a foreign country. Um, and I convinced people that were from uh, the UK they thought they were, they came back like oh you know they they were, it was amazing how many people were convinced no they're not i have to work on it i didn't spread any inf misinformation about the uk i never talked about anything um with regards to the uk i did ask some people from the uk what the accent sounded where it was from. Some people said somewhere in the middle, like Glasgow, when I was doing the accent regularly. But it's been, it's been a while. I have to, probably should just start binge watching Monty Python again. Glasgow. Oh, yeah, Glaslow. Glaslow. Oh, you know what else is wrong, Rustic? I got something else that's wrong for you. That's going to make every... UK, every UK person here is going to cringe when I say it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Buckingham. I've been to Buckingham Palace. Buckingham. It's supposed to be Buckingham or something like that. But I say Buckingham because it's annoying and it's funny. Go put your water in the microwave to make tea like a normal heathen. <laughs> Worcestershire Shire. Yeah, see, I knew Rustic would. I, there's that. And when I say, um, Nutella, it's Nutella, I think. Or is it the other way around? Work chest, sure. I always have a hard time with that word anyway. Worcester Shire. No, it's Nutella. Nutella. 
I just rustic uh, my friend Bugman when he shows up. It dry, we were <laughs> he would get so frustrated with me whenever I said stuff the wrong way. Oh man. I like, I'll be honest, Rustic, I like Zed. I like Zed better than Z. What up, Pearly Whirly? I also think aluminum is way cooler than aluminum. Add, here's something wild. You know when, so there's different ways of like, when you're spelling something on the phone and you're like, A for apple, um, A as an apple, you know, you're trying to say something and you're spelling it out so that people understand which letters you're saying. If you work at Disney and you work on the phones, all their, when they say their letters, they have to use, or not, I don't know if they have to, but every time I've called, all of them use, um, they all use uh, Disney character names for every letter. No, God! <laughs> no! <laughs> it is too much. Yeah, Alpha, Beta, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Foxtrot. Um, Goat? I don't know what G is. Like, I know a lot of them, but... Oh, golf. That's right. What's H? Ohm? No. H is Harry? Really? No, it's not. Is it? Hotel. That's what it is. I know I know a lot of them, but... Yeah. Is any has anybody watched or is watching? Um, don't tell me what to do, duty head. Has anybody ever watched Resident Alien with Alec Tudyk? Not with him, but like he's in it. Thanks, Rustic, because I am curious. Robin, I love you. You're the best. <laughs> he and I hang out all the time. Yeah, see, that's what I was going for, Ad. A language of the skies in English. Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Foxtrot, Golf, Hotel, India, Juliet, Kilo, Lima, Mike, November, Oscar, Papa, Papa, Quebec, Romeo, Sierra, Tango, Uniform, Victor, Whiskey, X-Ray, Yankee, Zulu. See, a lot of these I knew, but I... Yeah, Juliet is that one. It's Juliet. Well, this is the military version. I don't know. Everywhere is different. Everyone does it differently.
Uh, I love that there was a shirt that said Foxtrot Uniform Charlie Kilo. I didn't think that was funny. <laughs> I'm right and you're wrong and there's nothing you can do about it. Neener, neener, neener. <laughs> Hey, uh, you guys want some good news? I know we all like good news. Do you guys want some good news? You want some good news? So you know the, uh, how Twitch is doing the Affiliate Plus program where you can earn, if you get a certain amount of subscription points, you get 60-40 and then there's the 70-30. Well, last month and this month, so far this month, we are uh, over a hundred sub points. So one more month and then we get the 60-40 split. Yeah, so next month, as long as we get over a hundred, we're good. Yeah, I was like, oh, sweet. It's like I'm getting a bonus or a raise. Yeah, um, we've done pretty good. It's we've gotten uh, 100, 127 sub points last month and we're at 121 this this month. So, yeah. Well, it's it's all because of you guys. It's all you guys subbing. I'd like a job before a raise. I guess getting a job would be a raise, wouldn't it? Um, see, that's, that's a great question. And I will tell you right now, Rustic, how this works. So tier one subs, people that subscribe on their own, it's one point per sub. It's um, three points for tier two subs. And that's it. <laughs> gifted subs don't count for points. Multi-month gifted subs don't count. Um, prime subs don't count. It's only those that subscribe on their own, which kind of sucks, if I'm to be honest. Um, however, once it's established that we hit the points, then the 60-40 or the 70-30 split counts for all of it. So it's good. Yeah, it should count folk, but also when you think about it, People could, in theory, boost themselves, which seems stupid, but the 60-40 split, you have to be over 100, and the 70-30 split, you have to be over 300. So we're, we're pretty far away from the 300. <laughs> 